Hi, I'm Sarah from ST Microelectronics, and I'm here on our stand for Embedded World 2025 with Jean Julien. And Hello, Sarah. Hi, Jean Julien. We're going to talk about some news that is hot off the press since last week, which was the announcement of our most recent ultra low power microcontroller, the STM32 U3. And uh, best ultra low performance so far, right? Yes. And due to some very new technology. So tell us about the technology first, uh, Jean Julien. This technology is a near threshold. Near threshold is the way to reduce the voltage we apply to our internal transistor. Traditionally, on this technology, the voltage is 1.2 volts down to 900 millivolts. This is what we have done with the U5, which has the same Cortex M33 core. Okay. Now, with the U3, we go down with the same core down to 650 millivolts. Okay. And since the energy is the square of the voltage, we are gaining a lot of energy with this, this, te this technology. Okay, sounds fantastic. Um, but as you said in English, the proof is in the pudding. So I know that uh, for Embedded World, you guys did a benchmark exercise and we brought it here to show to everybody and share with our customers. Let's, di let's dive in. Okay, just first of all, tell me about the applications that we've targeted here. Yeah, so we are running uh, three application use cases. Okay. One uh, application, uh, consumer-like uh, human activity recognition with a duty cycle of 6%. So duty cycle is the percentage between the run and the stop mode. So it's quite important for a ULP application. Okay. Then a second application profile with industrial anomaly detection with 1% duty cycle and then a metering flow meter application with 0.2%, so with a bit more uh, stop mode. Okay, so really three very typical ultra-low power applications that we see our customers uh, yes, yeah, targeting. Yes, exactly, yeah. Right, okay, so what about the, the facts and the figures? <laughs> Let's have but a look. First of all, before we, I mean, how did we do? How are we compared to our competition? So we are uh, using our uh, measurement tool, the ST-Link V3 Power, and we are comparing with uh, two products from the competition. Yes, but are we better? Of course we are. Hey, that's what we want to know. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go into the detail. Let's go, let's go have a look. So one product which has a very good run uh, mode. Okay. And a second one which has a very good stop mode. Okay, fair enough. Credit goes, credit's due. Okay, right. And? You can recognize here the, diff, the three application profile here with the human activity recognition, yep. here with the industrial anomaly detection, and then the metering flow uh, meter. Right, okay, clear. What about the, the results? The, the results. Come on, tell us more. Results. Talk suspense. <laughs> so here is the value for the U3. Okay. And you can see it's twice better than the best product with the good uh, efficiency. Okay, twice. 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 And three times better than the product with the low static current. Okay, okay. So this is what we love to hear, and I think this is what our customers want to hear as well because we're we're really breaking the barriers here in terms of power consumption, right? Exactly. Okay. Well, fabulous. So if people want to see this in action, come and visit the guys at the stand. And otherwise, uh, if people want to find out more information, go to our website. st.com/slash. STM32U3. Perfect. Okay. Thanks very much, Jean-Julien. Enjoy the rest of the show. Thank you, Sarah. Okay. Thanks, everybody. Have a good day.